I don't know if you can hear that noise going on in the background, but that's my fan, and I need that going on because it's all I've got. I have to have the windows shut to stop all the bugs from coming in and people don't hear me outside. And it is quite warm, and like I said, that fan's all I've got, and uh, gotta do what I gotta do, but let's do it. So hey, it's Harry Husky, and I wanted to do something very, very different to the last two videos I've done, where I talked about 3D printing, where I started, and what I kind of suggested if you do get asked if you take commissions, if you do have a 3D printer. So moving away from 3D printing for this video, and instead, I want to take a look at how bad or good some of these Facebook, YouTube, or from what I've heard, TikTok advertised mobile gaming apps are actually like. Let's face it, if you're a regular user of YouTube, Facebook, or from what I've gathered, TikTok, there is a very good chance you've seen these ads for these questionable looking games. Uh, some range from, uh, some of them range from having terrible gameplay, not being like as advertised, um, poor control, or whatever, and, uh, uh. Now for this video, I'm gonna be trying three of them, and they are the most recent ones I've seen advertised mainly on YouTube, I may have seen them on my Facebook while scrolling from through a couple of times and they are this one called Idle Capitalists another called uh, Gardenscapes and this one How to Loot Pull to Pin Now one thing I do want to point out is that although I have installed them on my phone I have not opened them at all before recording this video so that for the very first time I'm going to find out what they are like I will <laughs> be doing so during this video. Now before I start playing these games, I'm going to be using some kind of play pass rating for this one. So play, a thumbs up, will mean it's good, I mean even though it may not be as advertised but it's decent, uh, the controls are fine, um, something, uh, yeah, so okay. <laughs> and then we have pass, which could mean um, not as described, uh, misleading, false advertising, poor control, poor quality, uh, stuff like that really. Okay, so I have my phone and my starlets at the ready and the first one we're going to be playing is Idle Capitalist, which If you've seen this particular game advertised on YouTube, you may have seen it looks kind of like something out of the world of Family Guy Or so it looks to be in the ads, but how is it actually like? Okay, so screen record on and here we go Idle Capitalist uh, just wanna... Oh, it's loading so I'll hold it like this so I can see everything that's going on at home. I um Welcome, let's, let's be the richest man in the world. Okay, so first up is the always the hard is always the hardest. Start with lemon juice, click here to make money. Um Um I I ah. I pressed the start! Why did you, uh, Uh, I do not like the look of this, but now do What the hell is this? Tired of clicking. Um. Let's just go back to menu. Maybe. What the hell is this game? Uh. Uh. <laughs> oh god. I just don't know what it's doing, it's making two dollars every two seconds. Time to do the poultry farming. What the hell is ah! well, Let's just stop for a second. This is what it was advertised as. <laughs> Here I am playing this. Uh, it's absolutely nothing like I can anywhere like how it claims to be. Okay, so just recording this while I'm in the phase of editing. Um, I've been looking at various gameplay videos and videos related to this particular game, and um, what I'm finding is exactly the same thing that I was going through <laughs> while I was trying this out for the first time. 
So one of them being uh, just exactly the same thing happening, uh, going nowhere as advertised. Um, one video comparing the gameplay to how it was advertised. Um, at one point, I just checked the reviews just to see what people have been saying about it. And this was the point where I decided to tell myself, yeah, enough is enough. Um, no, I, just, I, can't, I can't do this one anymore. So, uh, I don't know what the hell that was. I was just pressing on stuff, playing on stuff. Uh, it was just generating money, making money. I just didn't know what the hell that was. Um, so, play or pass. Uh, pass. Um, I might have to look into this properly after this video to see what it actually was, to see if there was... Um, anything like how it was in the, at all at some point in the game but for now I really just can't do this one anymore so. okay so moving on to the next one and we have Gardenscapes so here's one of the ads And now to see what it's actually like. You live in a large city. No, I don't. I Busy live in a village. streets, crowds of people, and never-ending traffic. I mean, maybe in London, but uh... hello, my name is Austin. I'm your great uncle's yeah, butler. Lost. You have inherited his beautiful. Uh. This that will do. Hi, I'm Barry Scott. Bang, and the dirt is gone. Um. Okay, so this is not what I thought it was going to be at all. So I've got Candy Crush, or in this case, Garden Crush. Match three pairs to. Where do I go? I I'll give I'll, I'll give this a little play because even though it's not described, um, it seems all right. There's. Really. Yeah, this is actually pretty decent. I mean, it's not like it was advertised, but um, nothing wrong with the gameplay. The controls are fine. And we're back to Garden Crush. I really don't know what to say at this point, I'm just so distracted. I'm kind of, I'm kind of sucked in by this. Because truthfully, I kind of like this. Okay, so I think I've seen something similar like this in the ads. Um, uh, bolt hides. Let's try that. Hey, done it. I'm going to go back to that because it's probably after this video because I don't want to really be... I'm a little bit stuck in by that actually, not going to lie. Um, but yeah, that was actually pretty decent. Um, uh, it looked fine. It looked it looked really good. Um, the controls are fine. Nothing lagging. Uh, overall, it was it was actually quite good. So, Gardenscapes... Um, yeah, let's give it a play. Play, yeah. <laughs> so. Now, the third and final one will be How To Loot. Now this one I have seen advertised many times with um, the caption I can't pass the first level. It's like, oh my god, why is this so difficult? I'm sorry, that was terrible. <laughs> I've got to make sure I just never ever do that again. But yeah, whoever is in their marketing department, um, <laughs> um, what they're basically saying, like when they say they can't pass the first level, they just may as well try to have a go at 
completing a one piece jigsaw puzzle. Okay, let's start talking and let's start playing. Okay, I had an issue with screen recording there, it just stopped all of a sudden, I really don't know why. Okay, and we're on some storyboards, which I can't skip for some reason, so I'm going to have to read this. Thank you, my wife will be so happy. First, I need $200 to pay rent. Pay. But I'm playing this game, why even bother downloading this? I wonder what Seth MacFarlane actually makes of this, considering it's very, very close to his style um, on the likes of Family Guy and American Dad. Pull that down first. Uh. Oh, for God's sake! What the hell is that dance he's doing? I don't know if I'm doing it right. <laughs> I usually don't drink before filming videos and this is pretty much why. <laughs> this is not going to go down well. This is... Okay, I'm a little bit confused. Okay, one fatal flaw I'm kind of noticing with this game. The touch controls are not sensitive enough. It's definitely not a stylus. This was working fine before I was filming this video. Um, a lot of the times I would try pulling, pulling on the pin and uh, nothing would happen. It would burge, it would move anywhere. So that's one flaw I've just discovered with this game. Okay, what's this part of the game? We need your help. Can you please rate us? Are you serious? No, I don't want to rate you yet. I've got my own rating system, thank you very much. It, it just feels like I'm the same thing over and over again. Like, I can tell the layout in, in part of the pins is different. So to... Uh, the love. <laughs> Do I just... No. What the hell? I was I was very gently trying to pull on it and then they just keep put... Are you for real? Okay, so apparently in this game you don't pull the pin like it says impartially on the App Store. You... You... <laughs> you tap the pin. Because all I've just done is just tap once on the screen and that's it, pin pulled. Ugh, that's not how it should work. Ah, uh, okay, you know what, I, I'm not going to do this for a while because this is, all these ads popping up is just dragging it on even longer. So that was How To Do, and, well, uh, I shouldn't have done this whole trunk. So the game is fairly okay the only major flaw i have with it is the touch controls um they weren't sensitive enough uh, they weren't responsive enough to the stylus and if i got a human to use their finger it would probably end up doing the same so what rating do i give how to do uh to be quite honest i'm very undecided after that i literally just didn't know what to make of it because although i could probably play that for hours it probably keep me quiet for or maybe I look at a long train journey or whatever. Um, I genuinely don't know whether to say play or pass for it. If it's if it does seem like your thing, then maybe go for it. 
So yeah, that was me trying out a few mobile gaming apps that I've seen advertised on YouTube. Um, I probably might do another one of these, definitely when I'm sober. And if that turns out like a shit show like this just did, then I probably won't do another one of these ever again. So, <laughs> so I'm going to save my sanity and end this video right there. And see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.